We're live. We're live. Yes. Good evening, the UK, and welcome to Help Save Live Comedy with me, Al Murray, the pub landlord, and Jade Adams. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hi, Al. All right, you're right. This bit fucking weird, isn't it? Yeah. Look at me though. I'm the COVID fucking miracle. I was bald in March. Look, <laughs> it all grew back. <laughs> I am. Um... I actually got rid of mine before here and uh -huh. I've given myself chemical burns from the beat that I've put on, on my up, face. On the old upper lip. Yeah, I should have just kept it if I knew you, you were keeping yours. Well, you know, there's benefits in being hairy, Jade Adams. Let me tell you that. It tickles nicely. Oh, nice. Mm. Was, that, mm. was that flirting? It's not, it's not flirting as such. It but feels we, like flirting We can now. upgrade it to flirting if we want. All right, later on, though. All right. We need mm. to give him something to hang around for. Crikey. Right, well, welcome to seven, possibly eight hours of this drivel. You lucky fucking people. Intercut with comedians, with games, with fun, and all the sort of enforced stuff that will replace live comedy for now. It's a, like an experiment, isn't it, Jade? It's an experiment, yeah. There's absolutely no one in the room with us whatsoever, yeah. except for some choice tables with, um, well, they've put some faces on the table. So joining us yeah. this evening, we have Nemo. Yep. All right, Nemo. From Finding Nemo. We've got... Yep. Um, I think that's Hugh Grant on the same table with Adele and Nemo. It looks like he's looking up Nemo's uh, fins. Yeah. Well, that yeah. sounds like Hugh. I so don't know if it sounds like Hugh at all, I'll be honest. <laughs> Who else yeah. have we got? We got oh, we got uh, Mike Myers from Wayne's World. Um, uh, we have Bill Nye, I believe. Um, oh, Dermot Morgan from Father Ted, tragically, has somehow joined us. Posh and, well... Just Bex, not Posh. No, Posh, not Bex. Posh is Bex. there. Posh is here. Um, uh, uh, we have, uh, there's a Bake Off table. Um, we've got, I mean, we've got, you know, basically, there's yeah. three Adele's over there as well. Yeah, there's three Adele's over They just knew I was coming. She's actually, I like that it's old Adele as well, because I don't yeah. know if you've noticed, I basically used to be an Adele impersonator. Oh, really? And me and 12 other women are actually out of a job now, because she's decided, I mean, we shouldn't be talking about her weight, but fuck me, Adele. Who am I going to come on stage and say <laughs> I look like? Eddie Izzard. <laughs> Yes, so, it's like live comedy in, uh, in many ways. They say with com comedy, what you shouldn't do is dissect it because it's like killing a frog. Yeah. So what we're doing tonight is we've killed a frog and we've wired it up to a battery. <laughs> and that is your live comedy tonight <laughs> as it jerks away on your screen at home. And we've got a Zoom, a Zoom of intelligent, discerning people, a front row of incredible people like Elizabeth and Faye and Sarah C and Maya and Shara and... Uh, and there's a bloke leaning on his elbow whose name I can't see who needs to fucking sit up, right? It's a comedy club, mate. It's not your lounge. It's not you're, you're scratching your nuts in your lounge while I speak to you, you scruffy fuck. Yeah? And then there's Adam Dempsey and there's someone out of shot noshing him off, judging by the picture there. <laughs> He's raising a glass to that notion. God bless you, Adam. Yeah? If only, eh? Now, <clears throat> right, so what have we got tonight then, Jade? Take us through it. So we got three sections this evening, which you're all going to be sticking around for, and we've all got your names in. Oh, look, there's some more there's people. Some more. Hello, Nicola, Matthew Collins, Mia, Doug and Elaine, Sunil Kakra, John F., Phil, Stephen Young. Jane's iPhone as well has joined in. <laughs> Jane's iPhone. It's very strange to see someone with the surname iPhone in this day and age. Um, uh, Pauline and Neil. Hello, Pauline and Neil. Look at them. Trapped together after many years of marriage. <laughs> Trying to do something with their evening, having spent four months together, having avoided each other for at least 25 years. God bless them. There's Ash and Katie there. Um, they're welcome. Someone called Florian. That is a brave name. That's right. Scott Robertson. Um, oh, look, it's just, it's just, the thing is, is what we have here is the fans of comedy yeah. gathered together via the miracle of the internet and you're stuck with us. They are, I mean, I'm fans of, you, are you guys are big fans of comedy, yeah? Fab, they are. That's a, that's a good sign. I mean, we can't hear any of you. The, the, issue, the issue here is, is that normally the fans of comedy, well, they're... I don't know what I'm saying, I'll be honest with you. It's really difficult. I can't hear anyone fucking... Normally, I've got an audience. Oh, you're going to have to just pick up for me. <laughs> <laughs> right. right, this is a massive experiment, guys. We've got uh, three acts this evening. There's yep. going to be a break in between each of them, so you can go off and... Well, um, uh, have sex, masturbate, or do whatever you need to do in the, the allotted time away from all of us. Uh, Deb Green looked excited by that uh, notion just there. Um, we've got loads of acts on, Al. We Tons have. of them. 
We've got tons of acts. Um, we've also, we're also going to do that thing like on Comic Relief. What we're not going to do, though, is play you a video of an orphan, the orphan child of a comedian who's tragically out of work as a result of lockdown. We're not going to do that. We're not going to play you some video of, of, you know, various comedians from the circuit starving and with a begging bowl. We're not going to do that, but we are going to ask you for money. There's a donation address. Uh, it's a crowdfunder, uh, which suggests that we're not really the hard-headed capitalists that stand-up comedy comedians actually are. It's a crowdfunder. Um, uh, so crowdfunder.co.uk slash help save live comedy. We've got signed photos. There's a box here at the Clapham Ground to be won um, to save live comedy. And of course your moral well-being because laughter, as we all know, is the best medicine, which is just as well in the absence of a viable fucking vaccine. Um, <laughs> God help us. <laughs> Um, also, something we're doing is if there are any new comedians watching, yeah. um, we're doing a little thing each week. We would like the new comedians to get in touch with us with a two-minute video about why you love comedy or something yeah. funny, and we'll stick you in the show for the next ones as well. Yeah, but don't be too good, all right? Fragile yeah, egos on this stage. Um, now, so people are watching on Zoom. There's our Zoom front row. We've been talking to them. Uh, I'll just have a look at... Um, there's uh, Florian Fisher. Um, there's, uh, there's John, exclamation mark. There's Leanne. There's uh, Rob Solheim, Mark Silver, Adam Shea, um, Pauline and Neil. They're still there. God bless them. They look like they're in a crew, an empty cruise ship. Um, uh, Sunil there, up in the top right-hand corner of my screen. And Jane's iPhone, still there. Leanne, look at them all. Beautiful people. But they're on Zoom. Facebook, of course. The, uh, the devil's loudspeaker. I understand we're speaking through that this evening. Um... To all the people on Facebook, and we hope that all the lads from Britain first watching tonight are enjoying themselves. Um, we're not in a rubber dinghy, so you can't get angry with us. And of course, um, at Twitch, never heard of it. No fucking idea what that is. It's probably a thing for scratching your balls. It's definitely for scratching your balls. Scratching your balls. Yeah, 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 excellent. Okay. Yeah. So, hello to everyone on Twitch as well. And who are we raising money for, Jade? We're raising money for the venues, because we were right. thinking about raising money for comedians, nah. but uh, nah, fuck that. Um, no. But we were thinking, wouldn't it be nice if comedians had somewhere to go after lockdown gets lifted, if it ever gets lifted, we hope it gets fucking lifted. Yeah. It'd be really nice if we could keep the venues open. So we yeah. thought that this crowdfunder would be useful if we raise money for the venues. And we've got a list of venues, haven't we, Al? Yeah, we have. Yeah. Go on. It's the Stand, the Stand Clubs in uh, Scotland and uh, Newcastle, of course. Um, uh, and what, the Gilded Balloon, of course. Yep. Yeah, Gilded Balloon. Yeah, what else we got? Uh, Top Secret Comedy Club in London. Absolutely. Um, the Pleasance Theatre, um, which is uh, in North London, and of course a, uh, uh, an esteemed venue at the Edinburgh Fringe. God rest its fucking soul. God, I don't know what to do with myself. It's August, and I'm not in Edinburgh. It's, it's like they've lopped something off me, Jade it's, Adams. It's the most... Uh, uh, it's tragic. It's really. a tragic it really fucking is tragic. business. Hot water... Comedia in Brighton. Um, and we want your favourite comedy clubs, please. Shout out your favourite comedy clubs. Let us know what your favourite comedy clubs are via these various means of social media. Or come and bang on the door here at the ground. We won't let you in. We're not allowed. No, you can't no. come. Please don't come. Yeah. Although what you can do at home, if any of you want to have like some fun and stuff, I can see all the Zoom people again. Yeah. If you guys want to have some fun, what we want you to do is go off to your toilet. And if there's a couple of you, this is much better. But I want you to make a nice little outfit out of the toilet roll you've got in your room. Yeah. Um, we know you've got a lot of it. Yeah. So like a nice little toilet roll outfit. I think Doug and Elaine are really going to jump on this. I'll be perfectly and also, honest. Um, currently, I'm drinking on my own. Um, I'll finish my first pint, obviously, of the evening which is the loosener, as we all know, and I will be having a couple of pints as the evening proceeds, or seven, as we all know, a couple actually means. And so I, what I would like to see is some of you joining me in a pint this evening, those, as we all know, the rules are pint for the fella, glass of white wine, fruit-based drink for the lady. If we didn't have rules, where would we be? France. If we had too many rules, where would we be? Germany with a far lower R rate. Anyway, <laughs> let's not get bogged down in that. Um, <laughs> you know what? It's a painful time in a country's history like the United Kingdom where the Germans are doing better than us, isn't it? It's a tough thing to deal with, isn't it, Jade? Yeah, but the Americans are doing them worse, so that's fine.